Hello, and welcome to our Fine BI training for beginners. In the third course, we will talk about how to analyze in the data editing page. In the previous course, we added three tables to the analysis subject successfully. After that, we automatically go to this page to edit data. The next step is to do more data processing analysis on this page. Let's start by taking a look at Commodity Sales Schedule Table. This is part of a set of information about the sales of goods at a chain of supermarket stores. We want to know when each store sold what products, how many were sold, how much they cost, how much money they made, and the document code that goes with it. We also want to know information about the products sold and the stores where they were sold. Now, let's look at Store Information Dimension Table and Commodity Information Dimension Table. Store Information Dimension Table has information about all the stores in the supermarket chain and each store has its own shop code. Commodity Information Dimension Table has information about all the products in the supermarket chain. A product code in this table is linked to a specific product. Then, we can merge the information from these three tables by matching store code and product code fields. Fine BI has a function called left right merge that can be used to do this. There are four different kinds of merge, so let's look at what makes them different. Now that there are two tables on the screen, we merge them together based on the names in the two tables. Union Combined Merge will take all the names from both tables and keep the information that goes with them. If the information for a name is missing, the cell will be blank. For example, Lucy only has her math grade and not her English grade, so after Union Combined Merge, the English grade will be blank. In the same way, intersection combined merge means to take the names that are in both tables and keep the information that goes with those names. Left merge means to keep the information that goes with the names of the first table, which can also be called the parent table. The left merge is the most common type of merge we use. In a similar fashion, right merge means to keep the information that goes with the names of the second table, which can also be called the right table. Back on Fine BI, we choose Commodity Sales Schedule Table, which has the most information, as the main table, click Left and Right Merge, choose Commodity Information Dimension Table, check all the fields, and click OK. Here you can see Merge Basis. Commodity Code is the basis for merging these two tables, which the system figures out automatically, or you can set Merge Basis manually. As for Merge Mode, we chose Left Merge. If you don't know which merge mode to use, you can move your mouse over this small icon to see what the differences are. Store Information Dimension Table is merged in the same way. Then, Shop Code will be the basis for the merge and the merge will still be a left merge. Once this is done, we'll have a table that lists all the shops and the products sold in each one. On the right, we can see a list of all the steps we've taken. We can click on a step to switch, change, or delete it. Now you can see that the merged data is presented in a very messy way. To make the table look better, we can change the order in which the fields are shown, putting the most important fields at the front. Here are two ways to do it. The first is to move the fields by dragging and dropping the table header. After doing this, you can see that the right side now has an extra field settings step, which means we are now in the field settings page. The second way is to add the field settings step and then drag the fields within the field settings page to change the order in which the fields are shown. We can also change the name of a field, change the type of a field, or stop a field from being shown from this side. Next, we want to figure out how much gross profit we made. You can use this formula column to do this. Enter the gross profit formula, sales minus cost. Here, you need to pay attention, the field must be clicked from the left for the calculation to take place, and the column name will be changed to gross profit when you click OK. Then, at the end, we can see a new column with information about gross profit. After this, we click save and update to save and update the changes we made to the data in Fine BI. At this point, if we want other users in the enterprise to be able to use this table for analysis, we can apply to publish this table to public data. 
Once the administrator has approved and set up the table for other users to use, other users will be able to see the data in the public data, add the data to their own analysis subjects, and do analysis. After publishing the data, we logged into Ioko's account, which already had access to the data, and saw that Ioko's account could see the data and use it to make analysis subjects.